you know, so that way it's not like thing. All right, so I'm gonna click, I'm gonna click uh, enter a few times. So that way. I'm gonna click enter, get the story going. Oh, wait, fuck. <laughs> wait, 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 I put, I put on my knee legs. Okay, wait, wait, okay, story. I am a Kleenex, not a knee legs. I put knee legs. I am a Kleenex in a trash can. I am looking for the person that threw me away. Also, in the trash can are heroin needles. Okay, there we go. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, here we go, here we go. Just say tissue. Okay, once again, we'll click enter a few times, then we'll go from here. Dude, we're getting lower real quick. All right, after this one. Oh my God, bro, bro. What, dude, what? Okay, okay. It's a, uh, okay, so I'm a Kleenex. I'm looking for the person that threw me away also in a trash can are heroin needles. Hmm. Well, I guess you can look there then, but where did you get those? I got them from a girl named Rachel, who was a friend of my sister's and she gave them to me when we were having trouble with our parents. She said they would help us get, get out of this mess. Oh, so you're saying your sister is dead now? What happened? She died in her sleep last night. Bro, what? Bro, I would just the tissue in the trash. Now Rachel's, Rachel's sister's dead. So, okay, so am I, am I the Kleenex? Or am I, or now do you want me to be the girl, the, you want me to be Rachel or do you want me to be the Kleenex though? Wait, I gave them, I got them, oh wait, Rachel's the drug dealer. Okay, no, Rachel's a bad girl, bro. Rachel needs to go to jail. Am I still the Kleenex? I could probably, I can make this Kleenex talk. Like, uh, I can I can make this Kleenex talk. Okay, I'll be Rachel's sister. Well, no, Rachel doesn't have a sister. Rachel was friends with the sister. But you know, okay, you know, I'll just become Rachel's sister. Uh, story. Uh, they find out that Rachel has a sister. And her name is. So if you leave open sentences, the AI will actually figure out her. See, like that. Her name is Mariah. So I'm Mariah now. Because you want me to be Rachel's sister. No. Now I'm the Kleenex? You said be Rachel's sister. Now you want me to be the Kleenex? Okay, you know, fuck it. Well, you know, I know how to do this. I know how to do this. I know how to do this. Uh, so her name is Mariah. She came to our house and found our mom passed away and sister dead in her room. Then she called the police. They took me out of the room when they came. I see. Okay. So I'll be the Kleenex still. Uh. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. It's not like you have a more powerful PC than me. But, um. Okay. I'll be the Kleenex. Let me figure out how I can, how I can wear this. Because I got I to gotta make the Kleenex come to life, right? If I can make the Kleenex come to life, then I can just be the Kleenex. Alright. So I just gotta keep adding stories before I start saying stuff. Because I gotta... Right now, I'm trying to get everything figured out. Luckily, they're talking enough. Okay, story. They look down and pick up the Kleenex. And realize it can speak... And was there when it was when the sister passed oh, well, I don't know the name of the sister still they looked down pick up the Kleenex and realized they can speak bro um, they looked down 
Uh, they say they they came for me too. Who are they? They the police. They looked down and realized and realized the Kleenex was always there. Hello, I am a talking Kleenex. I was mixed with heroin and gained the ability to talk among the living. There we go, baby. Okay, so the Kleenex name, okay, so the, they, uh, the AI was like, yo, we need the fucking, we need the Kleenex to have a name. The name of the Kleenex is Ken, which is kind of funny. Because it's literally the same letters in the word Kleenex, that's kind of good. Um. St uh, Ken explains what happened the night of the death all right let's see let's see what let's see what happens with ken now he explains that they never met before but he was following you and the sister for a long time he was watching when the sister died and he saved himself from being crushed when the building collapsed i had to leave the collapsing building before but I like this dude I'm a talking I'm a talk I had to leave the class building before but then I found the sister and we talked for a while before she died that one doesn't make sense let me re-roll that Bro, we know who Mariah is, though. Mariah is the sister, right? Yeah. So I had to leave the classroom building before. You think about what Ken said. I had to leave the classroom building before. Before what? Before Mariah died. Who's Mariah? Someone I was dating. Mariah. Dude, my... So my girlfriend died also? was also Rachel's sister and they have a curse put upon their family we got this though we got this Yes, Mariah was also Rachel's sister, and they have a curse put upon your family, you say? The reason why I'm here is that I want to warn you that the police are coming. The police aren't real cops. They are wizards from the other side and will hunt anybody who knows about the curse. Okay. Yeah, no, this family's fucked. What? It's like if, like... So they're just repeating... So this is, this is not usually how it goes. Oh, two months in a row. Zarf. Zarf, dude. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so they're still just talking about it. They're talking about how I'm the Kleenex that got mixed up with some heroin and gained the ability to talk. That's not the real you. The real you is much greater than the lonely Kleenex. Bro. Yeah, you dropped the yo-yo, my guy. Bro, so it's saying... um, Oh, dude, I gotta let Luna in. She's she's meowing like crazy. She's meowing like crazy, dude. She's she's going at it. I gotta grab her toy. If I grab her toy, maybe she won't beat my ass. Don't beat my ass. I'm grabbing your toy. Yeah, she's meowing like crazy. 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 
god. Weak. Bro, see, I've told you the story. So uh, I was like, damn, this story kind of falling off the change. But um, now it's saying I'm not even a Kleenex. The heroin basically sucked my soul. Okay, she's coming back to my fucking foot. Luna, you gotta go over there. Attack your toy over there. Quit bringing it towards me. Uh, do. Okay, what should, what should I do? What should I do? What should I do? Story? Should I, should I, Luna, I'm gonna kick your ass out again for the third time. If you quit, why do you... Why do you bring your toy to my foot all the time? Um, kill something? Oh, okay, okay. Uh, the wizards sh show up and blast s and start shooting out their wands. One of the shots lands a fatal hit. Do we know who we're with? Do something off the wall. I'm trying to. I'm trying to. I'm right now. Wizards are over here. Luda. All right, you out. I don't care how much you me out. You can't be attacking my fucking foot. I got like 25 cuts. You know, from you. Here, I gotta pick up your toy though. Uh, I got your toy. No, 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 no not the wires. There you go. Come on. Over here, over here, over here, over here. Come on, come on. This way. Put some shoes on. Bro, I'm not about to put shoes on just so I can play my fucking computer. The cat, she's just a baby right now. She doesn't understand. What? I died? Bro, I died. Bro, there's wizards showed up and start shooting their wands. One of the shots lands, lands a fatal hit on your head, killing you instantly, bro. Why would you have me kill? You're a fucking. I got this, bro. I'm about to. I'm about to like. Bro, they shot a Kleenex. I was alive. I was a I was a talking, communicating Kleenex. I oh I got this I got this. Uh, Ken Soul then leaves the Kleenex. Why am I having so much trouble spelling fucking Kleenex, bro? Kleenex and turns into. Okay, okay, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Ken Soul then leaves the cleanest and turns into smoke and disappears. You were killed by the real police and have gone for- Bro! Or so- <laughs> I'm gonna bring this fucking Kleenex back, bro. Or so they thought Ken- Ken's... Bro, she is attacking the door, bro. I am scared. Ken Soul then begins to grow back more powerful than the wizards could. Oh my god, bro. I... Okay. Bro, this fucking cat. I gotta let her back in. You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna put shoes on, right? I'll put shoes on so my cat doesn't get lonely and so that way I can fucking record. Then just pawn some gym shoes because this cat's a fucking dickhead. Okay. Just pawn these fucking Nikes I don't wear no more. I don't care. No, I can't because they're fucking mesh, really. So just break the room or a long ass hair. Put on my running shoes just so I can stream. Because my cat's a fucking dickhead. He wants to fucking attack me constantly. I got shoes on now, asshole. What are you gonna do? Immediately tack my foot. Yep, she's uh luckily I don't feel it, right? The shoes uh the shoes do help. It's actually kinda playful. 
Um. Oh, let's go! Let's go! Uh, so, or so they thought Kenso begins to grow more powerful than the wizards could imagine and take over their bodies. He hacks into the police computer and finds out everything he needs to know about them, then steals some of their uniforms. Oh, dude, let's go. That's lit. Um, what do I say? Or do? Gives the uniforms to his two friends with him. Okay. So there's still two people with me, right? We have to tell the others. You all run home, explain the situation to your other friend. Okay. Who th whose fucking name is this, right? John. What was that man called? Ken Soul or something? No, it, it was Ken. I mean, his name is Ken Soul. This confused you and John. Okay, so we got. I'm trying to figure out everybody's names. Wait a second, dude. Who the hell is John? Wait, I think... Wait. No, we are the only one here. These are some other guys that I know, and they are friends of Ken Soul. So my name is now Ken Soul, right? Uh, so John is another friend. Ask John what they should do about the wizard police. Have Goku come out the ceiling? Okay, I got you. Story. Uh, Goku shows up. From above, crashing through the ceiling. Super Saiyan No, it's like that, yeah. Super Saiyan 4. There we go. Four was fully evolved and he is pissed. Who the hell are you and what are you doing in my house? His voice is raspy from having a cold. Wait. You're the real Goku? The one that defeated Frieza? Goku got a cold? How do you have a cold? Right, let's see. Alright. I think we kind of set the... I think we gotta start over. I think the story got fucked. Somewhere through. Alright. So... Yeah, yeah. So, the moral of the story is... Don't try to be smart. Goku laughs at your comment and tells you what happened a few months after you had left. Goku got sick with some bad. Okay, yeah, yeah, we're gonna start over. We're gonna start over. Custom. All right, what's it? What do you want to be? What do you want to be? What do you want to be? Uh, uh, 
I want to do something like weird, right? I got it. 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 You are an assassin that can teleport from another planet. You are trying to finish the last job or the last kill before retirement, but then, there we go. But then you're not really a killer. What? What am I? You're just an old man who likes to play one on TV. You look at your watch and realize it's getting real dark, so you need to get back home as fast as possible. What? Alright, we'll just do like one more, one more. You decide to take a shortcut through town since there's no reason uh, for you to be in this place right now. Some thugs stop your car in the middle of the road and tell you to get out. Okay. They find it pretty bizarre that they would, that you would be, okay, I, my bad. I'm not in a car, I was uh, walking home. Okay, so this is, so I put in that I'm an assassin that can teleport from another planet and I'm trying to get my last kill before retirement. And then the AI was like, psych, my guy, you're actually just an old man and an actor and you're, and then, and then, uh, then it said I'm going home, and then I put that some thugs are gonna pop out. Uh, say, okay. I should have named myself, right? I gotta start naming myself. That's like the thing. Hello, my name is Yo Yo. I'm just walking home right now. What are you fellas doing out this way? I'm trying to talk like an old man. I assume old man say fellas, right? Fellas. Okay, my name is Yo-Yo Jones. You might want to turn around and head back home. There's a man named Ezekiel with some very bad intentions. You ignore, you ignore the thugs and ask, who is Ezekiel? Story. The thugs explain that Ezekiel is a mob boss and will shoot anybody who goes on his turf late at night. There we go. Okay, so we're, well, I guess I should turn around then. You get back in your car and drive off. The thugs run after you, but they're are a few car length behind you, so you have some time. Why are they following me? Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. You get to the closest 24 hour video store and go in. You see a thugs parked right in front of the place. A pretty girl is behind the desk and asks what you want. Okay, so here's the thing, right? Do I want to. Do I, like, do I want to call, like, am I playing an old man or should I just throw the story, like, off the rails, right? Like, should I just throw, like, should I just throw the story off the rails? Or should I play it safe and be, like, an old man? I, if I'm playing it safe, I would call the cops, right? If I'm an old man, like, getting followed by thugs, I assume he would, like, call the cops. Off the rails? Bet. Uh, do? Uh... Before going back outside, you go to the restroom where you put together an M16 you had hidden in in your in your pockets in your in your uh
I don't know if I can say that in the story, right? Have it shoved up your ass. <laughs> I'm just gonna say hit it in your jacket. Hit it in your jacket. Okay, so now I'm an old man when I'm 16. I'm about to... You head back outside and tape the building. You then notice the dogs parked across the street. They're clearly watching you. The girl comes over and asks, Hi, do you need trouble finding something? Uh, go outside and start shooting your M16 at the thugs. Bye. You hit the hood of one of the cars first and the driver leaves down and starts shooting back. You dive in front of a car taking cover while you reload. You then notice that... Alright, what, what am I going to notice? You die for a car taking cover while you reload. You then notice that you always had some trouble with cars and this is nothing new for you. But it did give you a chance to think, what the fuck? What? Okay, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna keep blasting until you tell me why you are following me. Ah, uh, let's see, let's see. The girl tells you she thinks you probably knew each other in the past but can't remember where then she heads to the back doors and calls the police. Fuck, dude. So the girl's there, right? Okay. Quick rundown. I'm an old man that's an actor. Some thug stopped me, told me Ezekiel. Ezekiel is a man that will kill me. So then I left and then the thugs followed me and now I'm in a shootout with them. And there's a girl that works there. Oh, dude, I got it. I got it. I got it. Uh, you tell the girl to wait and ask what her name is. Okay. 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 What's the name of the girl? My name is Katia, she answers. She asks you what yours is again. While you finish reloading your gun, you tell her and she introduces herself. Okay, so. You say, Katia! Oh, dude, this is where it's gonna get fucking crazy, right? You're gonna say, Katia. Maybe one question mark. I once had a daughter named Katia, but she... Got kidnapped at the age of four. Oh, really? Drama at birth? That's where we are twins, you know, Katia says. Yes, I'm pretty sure we're both named after Roman goddesses, too. What the fuck? Katia. Turned. No way. Katia then explained how she murdered your daughter and stole her identity and stole her life. No, I, I, identity. I don't know how to spell identity. They've stolen my identity. Identity. Okay. Just find out. I'm 23. To become a teacher. She also claimed she had no idea that you had a daughter. I spelled it. I spelled it. I spelled it. Oh, whoops. Okay, so... So, Katia... Killed my daughter, stole her identity to become a teacher. If you were to become a teacher, then why are you working at a video store? 
Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw another fucking monkey wrench after this one. I need some money. I did some babysitting on the side and I was going enough to pay a apartment to get food. Or wait, you have a car and a driver's license? Shoot Katia in the head and avenge your daughter's life. You then stand up and throw a and throw and th you then stand up no Luna and shoot the gas tank of the thugs car all right we're about to, we're about to escalate the story you haul off and shock a T in the head a fact a fact that she was not expecting at all What's my name again? Oh yeah. Yo-Yo Jones is now an actual killer. No longer an actor. He realizes there is, this is no time for deception. He starts to feel sick, but took, but Oh, I killed the thugs! Bro, I killed the thugs! Um, a god from above descends. A god from above calls for you. Okay, let's, let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. To stop shooting and come with him. You fall without hesitation. You follow the guy into a building marked police. And you are transported to a local police station. What are you doing for the rest of the stream? I don't know. If you want to play something, I'm down to play something. Zarf. I'm just chilling right now. I'm just doing this. If you want to play something, let me know, my guy. I'm not sure what to play so i'm down for whatever i don't know you come up with it i'm gonna i'm gonna you know apex you know we got apex we got uh we got killing floor now we have fall guys you know we can always just get another game right we can get another co-op game and download that shit real quick you know i'm down i got a 600 dollars stimulus check baby I'm, I'm loaded i'm loaded just let me know what you want to play Anything. I mean, go find like an awful wall game on Steam and be like, yo, this shit's two players. Let's, let's hop in it. But real quick, I'm trying to just, I'm trying to make this local pol The. No, I don't have Microsoft Game Pass, unfortunately. But I mean, I can just buy the game you want. The police station turned into heaven. How do you spell heaven? I spell heaven. Heaven. That doesn't look right. Have on. Dude, I keep for okay, that makes sense. That looks right. I just keep forgetting that there's an A in the beginning. Luna, what are you doing? Local police station turned into heaven. You are surrounded by gods. Okay, here we go. For a dollar for a first month? I'll probably, I don't know. Why, what game are you thinking about getting? You are led into a large room and where you ask to your seat. You choose a table near the window so you can watch the world go by. Bro, I'm in outer space. Can you gods please give me the power to kill anybody who has done evil? Let's see. Let's see. You ask the guys for a power to kill, and without a doubt, you get a resounding yes. The power is inside. You only need to reach in and grab it. You reach inside your soul and pull out a katana. 
that can only cut people with tainted souls. Oh, let's go, baby. You grab a machete and begin to hack people to death. You hack them until their souls are the pure. Bro, no, wait, no, we can. We're changing that to katana. All right. There we go. Can you gods also give me the ability to teleport? But yeah, I don't know what game you want to play though, Zarf. You can't attack them where they live if you were so inclined. Meanwhile, a man enters the police station and asks for Mr. Mr. Reynolds, an old man with white hair and a walking stick, answers the door. The man appears to be in his late 60s, early 70s, but his face is that of a 150-year-old man. What are you doing at this station? Are you also another god? Oh, fuck. I just want to say it real quick. I just want to say this is how, this is how smart I am, right? This is how smart I am. No, I'm just a conservative citizen. I'm here to see you're okay. Your face looks haunted. Uh, I'm not sure what you mean. Um, so look at this. Ready? So I started it out with I'm an assassin from that can teleport from another planet, right? But the game, the game made me into an old man who just plays an assassin on TV. And through all of this shit, right? Through all of me meeting thugs, Ezekiel finding a woman the woman then murdered my daughter so then i killed her and then the thugs that were following me to then meet gods to where now i have a katana and can teleport i just i i i brought the story back now now this is where now this is where it's gonna get good right do you know a man known as and we can scroll up so I spell it right. Ezekiel. See if I can see if I can get Ezekiel. Oh my god. Mr. Reynolds goes quiet for a second and looks confused, and he replies, e Ezekiel? That's my son, you see. I don't think I ever told you his first name, did I? Say his name is very popular in this town. Do you know what he does for work? Ah, oh, dude, this is great. Well, now that's a weird question coming from you. I mean, I know Ezekiel is a policeman, but. But. But he is also a, a vampire hunter in the training. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Bro. Yo. Listen. Look, he's a... This is... Dude, I just pieced this together right now. He's a vampire hunter in training. Because... Whoever comes on his turf late at night because they're vampires. A vampire hunter? But vampires can't be real. Bro, this is great. Well, they aren't, but he is. His mom is a vampire and dedicated his life to killing them. You are now confused. Wait, so you and Ezekiel brother... Bro, wait, so... Wait, so are you and Ezekiel brother or father? No, we already know their brother. We can, we can, uh, we can delete this one. 
We can take that one. Why would he want to kill his own mother? Ezekiel, dude. You don't become the greatest hunter against something you have dedicated your life to killing. That's just stupid. Okay. You go to... Ezekiel's hideout and talk to him about vampires. Alright, let's go to... Let's see if we can find Ezekiel. Hey, as my name, a man called Mr. Reynolds was looking for you. Oh, I know who you are. He's a local vampire expert. Expert? He said you were training to be one. Training, is that all he wanted to hear? I was his right-hand man until he kicked me out for being too uppity. My name is Yo-Yo, and I have... What the hell is Fogs? What the hell is F Fogs, though? And I... have been... given... a sword... a katana... by the gods that can kill evil. That includes vampires. Look it up on Steam, it looks funny. Alright, one second. Let me look it up on Steam. Yo, you're ruining the narrative, my guy. Store. Would you just fucking fall? Um. PHO. Did you spell it right, my guy? I don't even think you did. You spell it right. I I put in P H O G S. I don't know. It didn't. Nothing popped up. Oh, I found it. I found it. It actually. Yeah, I don't know. I put in P H O G S. It didn't pop up. You have to put in the exclamation point. Is it even co-op? What the hell is this? What the fuck is this? Um, very positive reviews. Yeah, if you want to play that, I'm down. You want to play it? I'll buy it right now. You want to play it? I'll buy it. I'll get, all right. I'm buying right now. It's bought. <laughs> Got it. It's done. That easy. Where's that? Let me download it. Install. Takes like three minutes to install. Easy. Alright. I am installing. Right, let me go back to uh go back to the story real quick. Luna, watch out. You want to lay over there? Where do you want to lay at? Uh, okay, you say my name is Yo-Yo and I've been given a katana that I can kill evil and clues matter. Is that so? He says, you know, you have his intention now. Yep, they gave it to me as a gift. You interested? But first, I must see if it can cut you. The katana can only cut people 
who have tainted souls. Well, do your worst, vampire. Ezekiel Smite. Oh my god! I am no vampire, but since it cut you, you have a tainted soul, and I must end you. Good one. You kill evil, not the person wielding the sword. You continue to talk to Ezekiel while drinking his blood and burning him at the stake? I'm not a vampire. I'm an assassin. Oh, it was all... Wait. Was this all part of your plan? When you want to play it, Zarf. Well, I was, well, I was going to have to kill Mr. Reynolds, but since you're so efficient at doing it myself, I think you deserve a raise, Mr. Who's who? Mr. Reynolds laughs out loud while you feel your head exploding. The gods are telling you that you must kill Mr. Reynolds because B C A U S E B C A U S E because he is the devil himself. Luna, I'm trying to kill Mr. Reynolds. Mr. Reynolds is ruled by your belief system. Don't take, didn't take it for religious man, but then in the gods is for weak-minded foes. You must kill Mr. Reynolds because he is the devil. You must kill Mr. Reynolds because of God, because the gods man. You must kill Mr. Reynolds because the voice in your head is telling you to do it. You leap towards Mr. Reynolds and try to cut his head off. No, you don't leap, you teleport. Duh. You teleport towards Mr. Reynolds and try to cut his head off. But Mr. Reynolds teleports behind you and slashes your throat open, blood pours out, and you die instantly. Wonders why he wasn't strong, but strong enough to kill Mr. Reynolds. Like he wanted to. Let's do, let's do a few enters. Let's do a few enters. Yo, yo, wonder why he was strong enough to kill Mr. Reynolds like he wanted to. Yo, I wonder why I was trying to kill Mr. Reynolds if you're going to. Mr. Reynolds burst out laughing. Well done, well done. You dig deep down and find the power to come back to life. I don't want to die. I'm cheating, dude. Oh my god, bro. Mr. Reynolds is roasting me. Mr. Reynolds angry. What the hell? You can't even make it through your first mission while getting killed. Are you seriously that weak? Mr. Reynolds summons the dead. Your remains are dumped on them. This is what you get for using a half hour's necromancer. Next time, try to send someone more powerful. Mr. Mr. Reynolds summons a horde of undead leaping to your death. Mr. Reynolds laughs. These are the ease levels. Once we get to the really hard ones, I might have to kill you myself. 
you slice through all the undead with the thought of avenging your daughter Katia and finally making it to heaven rightfully. Dude, this shit, dude, this story's fucking great. You let out powerful screamers and release all your anger at the other day, calling them down as they reach you. Mr. Mr. Rounds lets out a shriek of pain as he is stabbed through the back. You see and you catch Mr. Reynolds before he can before he can kill Mr. Reynolds with a backstab. There's two Mr. Reynolds. <laughs> Mr. Reynolds turns around and leaps at you. His sword meets your axe. I don't have an axe. I have a sword. Fuck it. Let's see what happens. Maybe I have an axe now. Mr. Reynolds is a backstabber. You learn that he is also weak from the front. You snap Mr. Reynolds' neck, killing him and saving Mr. Reynolds' soul from being trapped in hell. Oh. The devil took control. <laughs> control of Mr. Reynolds. And that wasn't the real Mr. Reynolds. Bro, there's something Mr. Reynolds getting tossed around. Bro, I don't know who the fuck is who. You are now the king of England and you need to make preparations for war. All right, we're going to call it there. The moral of the story is... Even a weakling like you can rise up against the devil. Hamlet is on the castle wall. Easy. Let's go. Uh, a, a nuke uh, blows up the planet. Fuck it. The planet Hamlet in England wins? Let's just see how we were here. Zarf, you, you ready to play that one game? You are shot into outer space. The story itself, though, all this was pretty fucking good. Mr. Reynolds, you were shot in outer space by Nazis? You're. Dude, I was shot in the outer space by Nazis, Mr. Reynolds. <laughs> And Mr. Yo-Yo are still competing over who is more evil. I'm not evil. All right, that's going to call it today, though. I have 78 energy. Can I charge up? I have no scales, bro. I got to buy dragon scales. But, I mean, this is fun. AI dungeon. Recommend it. I mean, you get energy, but it replenishes over time. Like, right now, I wasted 25 energy, but I've been doing it for an hour. If you're going to do this shit for four.